What's up everybody? In this video, I'm going to show you how to farm airdrop for Orbiter Finance. But before I'm going to show you the projects and all the steps how to do that, just have to state something. I'm not a financial advisor. This is not a financial advice. This video is for educational and entertainment purpose only. Always do your own research before investing money into anything. So if we're going to go to their Twitter page and it's interchange scaling solution for Ethereum. It's basically a layer two and a cross roll up. And if we scroll down, we can actually find more information about this project just in general and read about it. And then we can go to GitHub and find out even more, like get all the details. And we can also go to their main orbiter.finance page to look at their website and interface. But before we're going to do that, let's jump into Discord really quick. And then if we're going to open up frequently asked questions. And as you can see, one of the first question is, will there be a token? And yes, so team actually confirmed that there is going to be tokens. And then let's go to their website. So this is their website kind of looks like some kind of swap like Uniswap pancake swap or something similar. But this is just a bridge. As you can see right now with version one, you can transfer Ethereum, USDC, USDT and DAI. And I think that's also available on version two. But I'm in this video, which is going to be looking at version one to do that, what you need to do just connect your MetaMask wallet. Once your wallet is going to be connected first, most likely you're going to have Ethereum blockchain. So we're just going to have to change this from the first one from Arbitrum to Ethereum and then just bridge either to Optimism, Lania, ZK Sync, Polygon, Arbitrum Nova, Loopring, Immutable X, Starknet, and BNB Chain. So you have plenty of options to do that. Just try to choose the cheapest gas as possible so that way you can make more transactions. And then once you're gonna do that, you'll just have to press on max and then it's gonna let you know how much it's gonna cost. And right now I have an efficient funds, but then it will give you an option like to proceed and it would just swap and your token would appear on optimism. And let's say, for example, if you don't know how to add different chain to your MetaMask, what you need to do, just go to MetaMask and then in here, just press on the chain and then add a network. Then this window is going to appear and right here, you just have to press add and it's going to give you quite a few options. I already added a few like Polygon and Optimism and that's why they're not here. But if you're just doing this first time, you would see them here. Then if we go back, so this is just website really easy to use. And this is what you need to do to start farming. And we're going to go a little more into details. And then if you press on history here, you're going to be able to see actually how many transactions have been completed. So in my case, I did one from Ethereum to Arbitrum, and then I was just kind of going back and forth. But also don't do them too often because they're going to think that you are a bot. So maybe from five to 10 a week, not more than that. Then if we go to the another website, guild.xyz, Orbiter Finance, and I'm going to leave all links in the description below. Right here, what you have to do, you're just going to have to connect your wallet, Discord, Twitter, and there's a couple tasks you need to do. Then you're going to become a member. You'll have to join the Discord and then just verify that Twitter. And then if we scroll down, as you can see, there's a different roles in the Discord. So there's a pilot role. If you do from 10 to 49 transactions, there is a trainee pilot from three to nine. And then there is elite pilot from 50 to 99 transactions and then an etc. And the highest one is the ace pilot. So it's 500 and above transactions. And to get that role, roles always going to be assigning on Monday. And as you can see, the ace pilot, this is the highest role you can get so far. Looks like 354 people got it that high. And the higher we go, the more people got it. So this right here is just to keep track where you at and with all your process. And then the next page, if we're going to go, this is basically where you would be able to actually mint one of the NFTs. And I'm not entirely sure exactly how all this tied to, but this NFT probably would be link to your role or to your badge which level you are at because what i did i got like nine transactions so i was able to get that trainee pilot and if we go back in here as you can see that trainee pilot from three to nine and i got nine transactions so this is the nft i was able to mint 
from here and the higher you're gonna get different nft you're gonna be able to mint and this is pretty much it this is literally what you have to do just make swaps from one chain to another and get the higher roll that possible the higher the roll most likely the bigger airdrop you're gonna get and again as i stated earlier this is not a financial advice and at this time this airdrop is just a speculation is gonna happen or not nobody knows 100 percent for sure but this project looks very promising and this is pretty much it all the websites that i showed you in this video i'm gonna leave links in the description below and thanks for watching